A historic inaugural flight recently landed in Jamaica and Inter-Caribbean Airways. New flight could lead to other flight destinations all throughout the Caribbean region. Our One Caribbean News, DeAndra Hamilton reports. The Ian Fleming International Airport at Boscobel in Jamaica, a new flight could mean new connections throughout the Caribbean. Dubbed flight JY007 to match the mystique of the airport named in honor of the James Bond 007 author Ian Fleming, Inter-Caribbean took off from the PLS on Thursday, landing an hour and 20 minutes later in Boscobel, which also flanks the famous city of Ocho Rios in Jamaica. On hand for the arrival of the inaugural flight, Minister of Transport Audley Shaw and Minister of Tourism Edmund Bartlett. We do that. Then the investment that the government has made here would be worth it. So let us not get stuck on a label. Let's get on with the substance. I wish all the success for this facility. The flight was inspired greatly by Sandals Resort's international mogul, the late Butch Stewart. He was remembered by Chairman of Inter-Caribbean, Lyndon Gardner. Kingston Airport, with onward connections throughout a network of 16 countries and 26 cities, across the Caribbean. Missing from this event today, that is the chairman. He is always been known as, I'm talking about Mr. Butch Stewart. On board was the CEO of the airline, Trevor Sadler, corporate partners and friends, members of the media, and they all received a certificate marking the historic flight. On the ground, strong talk about the urgency to enable Caribbean connectivity. Because people travel to fulfill their passions. And these passion points are made out in products. And these products are driven by various type of skill applications. Inter-Caribbean Airways will run its flight monthly initially and then upgrade to weekly. From Boscobel, also known as Ocho Rios in Jamaica, DeAndre Hamilton reporting.